Welcome to MMA 101. Today, we're going to look at the guillotine choke. This is a white belt move. It was very popular in MMA in the early days. Fighters have learned to defend it, but now it's come back into fashion with some great fighters like John Jones putting to sleep some very experienced grapplers with this move. So even though it's a white belt move, it's used all the way up to the black belt level. Again, they battle in another big knee. 45 seconds. John's got his head. Second. He's got a choke. Trying to choke him out and He's finish the fight here. here. Leona's in trouble. Trying to finish this fight. Here we are standing. Now, normally from the standing position, our opponents are expect expecting strikes, knees, elbows, punches, and kicks. But today we're gonna catch them off guard. We're gonna go for a submission. We're gonna have a look at the standing guillotine. Now, this is a move that is very easy for anyone to pick up. It's a white belt technique, but it can also be used at a black belt level. The problem is a lot of people know how to defend this. So if I were doing this in MMA, uh, in the cage, I would actually use the cage to stop my partner from escaping and get out of here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to snap his head down. Here, I need to pull it down. I'm going to drop my shoulder on the back of his neck because I've got to stop him getting up. And I'm going to drive him down a little bit. And he's going to start to come in here. Now, from here, our traditional way of grabbing the guillotine, if I grab my own hand, as he comes forward, I'm going to lift up here. Now, at this point, if I was in the middle of the cage area, he could probably start doing an escape. I'm gonna drive him up against the cage, so now he can't move backwards, and this is going to give me even more pressure. Now, one of the variations a lot of guys do is they grab their own hand, and John Jones did this really well, so he changed the grip, started pushing up, came in, and put Leota Machida asleep. So that's our guillotine, so let's see that again. From the wrestling position, Snap down, I need to get my shoulder on top to put weight here. My hand dives through. I come in, drive him up against the cage. To get it deeper, I pull the hand through. I'm gonna switch my grip, start pushing really tight, squeezing my bicep, and again, cage is behind him. And as I squeeze, I'm gonna drive him into the cage as I lift, and that guillotine choke comes on. If you don't tap, you will go to sleep as Leota Machida did, and he collapsed into a heap on the ground. 